African Union Communications Early Warning and Intelligence, commonly known as AUC3I, is an intelligence and security organization responsible for providing signals intelligence and information assurance to AU citizens, AU leadership, and AU armed forces. I'm Colonel A.C. Ogentoy, an infantry officer. I am responsible for leading infantry soldiers at all levels of command and combined armed forces during missions on the ground. This is today's briefing. On the progress of the Special Military Operation on the 7th of October, 2023. The armed forces of the Russian Federation continue the Special Military Operation. In Kupansk direction, the Zapad group of forces supported by aircraft, artillery, and heavy flamethrower systems repelled five counterattacks of the armed forces of Ukraine 4th Tank Brigade and 66th Mechanized Brigade near Makievka, Lugansk People's Republic, and Lyman Pervy, Kharkov region. In addition, Russian units inflicted losses on manpower and hardware of the armed forces of Ukraine 14th, 30th, 32nd Mechanized Brigades, and 115th Territorial Defense Brigade near Kapansk, Sinkovka, Lyman Pervy, and Ivanovka, Kharkov region. Over 40 Ukrainian troops, two armored fighting vehicles, two motor vehicles, one Polish-made Krab self-propelled artillery system, one U.S.-made M777 artillery system were neutralized. In Krasny Lyman direction, the center group of forces units, Army Aviation, artillery repelled one attack of an assault detachment of the armed forces of Ukraine's 63rd Mechanized Brigade close to Chervenaya Dybrova, Lugansk People's Republic. The armed forces of Ukraine losses amounted to more than 65 Ukrainian troops, two pickup trucks, one Akatsiya self-propelled howitzer, two D-30 and one D-20 howitzers. In Donetsk direction, units of the U group of forces supported by aviation and artillery repelled three attacks of armed forces of Ukraine assault detachments near Kurtyamovka, Veseloy, and Severnoy, Donetsk People's Republic. The enemy's losses in this direction during the day amounted to up to 190 Ukrainian troops killed and wounded, three motor vehicles, one U.S.-made M777 artillery system, and one D-30 howitzer. In South Donetsk direction, the Vostok group of forces repelled three attacks of the armed forces of Ukraine 127th and 128th Territorial Defense Brigade's assault detachments close to Pryetnoy, Zaporizhzhia region. Ground attack aviation and artillery launched attacks at manpower and hardware of the armed forces of Ukraine 58th Motorized Brigade and 79th Air Assault Brigade close to Eurozainoy and Novomikolovka, Donetsk People's Republic. The enemy lost up to 225 Ukrainian troops killed and wounded, two armored fighting vehicles, two motor vehicles, one D-20 howitzer, as well as one electronic warfare station. In Zaporizhzhia direction, units of the Russian group of forces supported by ground attack aviation and helicopters hit manpower and hardware of the armed forces of Ukraine 80th Airborne Assault Brigade, 65th and 118th Mechanized Brigades near Uspanovka, Rabatino, Malayatok Machka, Zaporizhzhia region. Up to 50 Ukrainian troops, two armored fighting vehicles, and two pickup trucks were eliminated. In the course of the counter-battery warfare, one Stubby howitzer, one D-20 howitzer, and one M46 towed field gun were neutralized. In Kherson direction, up to 30 Ukrainian troops, two motor vehicles, and one D-30 howitzer have been neutralized by fire. Two armed forces of Ukraine sabotage and reconnaissance groups were eliminated on Alashinsky and Periaslavsky Islands. Operational Tactical and Army Aviation, Unmanned Aerial Vehicles, and Missile Troops and Artillery of the Russian Groups of Forces have engaged armed forces of Ukraine manpower and hardware in 121 areas during the day. In addition, one Armed Forces of Ukraine Military Equipment Depot has been obliterated close to Ilichevsk, Odessa region. The command post of the Armed Forces of Ukraine 95th Airborne Assault Brigade was hit near Pobeda, Donetsk People's Republic. Ukrainian Air Force air-delivered ordnance depots were destroyed near Dubivka, Cherkasy region. One ammunition depot of the Armed Forces of Ukraine 1st Special Operations Brigade was destroyed close to Ogurtsovo, Kharkov region. Armed Forces of Ukraine aircraft fuel depots were destroyed at Ozanoy Airfield near Zydomir and Mergorod Airfield in Poltava region. 
Russian air defense units intercepted one Su-25 aircraft of the Ukrainian Air Force near Priobrazenka, Zaporizhzhia region. Air defense units shot down seven MRS MLRS projectiles and four harm anti-radiation missiles during the day. Moreover, 38 Ukrainian unmanned aerial vehicles suppressed and neutralized close to Rubeznoi, Svatovo, Lugansk People's Republic, Mospino, Novoselovka, Veseloy, Donetsk People's Republic, Romanovskoy, Vishnovoy, and Skelovatoy, Zaporizhzhia region. In total, 487 airplanes and 250 helicopters, 7,610 unmanned aerial vehicles, 440 air defense missile systems, 12,387 tanks and other armored combat vehicles, 1,161 combat vehicles equipped with MRLS, 6,679 field artillery cannons and mortars, as well as 13,892 units of special military equipment have been destroyed during the special military operation. Thank you so much for watching this video. We hope you found it useful and informative. If you have any questions, please leave them below and we'll get back to you as soon as possible.